am. We are recording. Hello. And nobody can see your face because your internet is slow. Yep. I blame the usual parties. Internet service provider. You know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not naming any names. Um, right, so what, we're, we're back. Deja vu. Mm -hmm. Formerly good show. Mm -hmm. Gloriousness. Um, and this is... We're still working on the post that we were doing last session. Um, but we're, we're pretty close, I think. We've only got... For this for this post, we've got a no, paragraph. No, no, no. Oh, uh, oh. We are talking about scenes. We are finalizing scene one. This is not the whole whole post. Oh, okay, right. So we've almost finished scene one of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This. All right, cool. Um, and it's the good bit. <laughs> it's the good bit that we've got to get to. Um, so yeah, the uh, the whole post is supposed to have. According to these notes, three scenes or like two and a half? Hmm. Scene two, scene three, yeah, okay. So the the whole beach shenanigans is like uh, a lead up to the crew getting acquainted with the new weir weirdness of their updated ship. And so, oh, <laughs> okay. Look, people, I'm in a terrible mood today. Um, <laughs> so, okay. And to top it off, the cat has just appeared at the windowsill. Come on, Ike. I'm busy. No! I'm working. Come on. I'm working yeah. here. Right, I'll be back in a second. I've got to let her out the door now. Oh, because this room is just a pathway, apparently. <laughs> Her Royal Highness has abdicated the room. <laughs> okay. Her Royal Highness has gone to poop. Mm -hmm. Probably. Does she not poop outside? Sometimes. Uh, other times, not. <laughs> I see. Yes. And sometimes she misses the little train early, which is always mm. fun. Thanks, Kit Kat. <laughs> Um, right, okay. Where are we? Where do we want to start? I think uh, we can skip ahead the beach action right now. So let's let's start working on scene two and return to scene one later at the later date. Huh? Because, because I don't I don't expect to get it all done today. I don't expect to post it today. So. Oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> as da da da. So this is probably as they, as someone steps through the door or whatever, Alexis, uh, or whatever Alexis looks like. The, is she just the screen avatar at the moment, or is she? Oh, would you, would you show you around? I will switch to 3D just, uh, projection. Just focus on the dialogue, and I will I will check which stages uh, she goes through. So. And see, all this has been written here already. Initially, Alexis will appear on screen. So, stop, quit worrying about all that altogether, and just just stick to what Corey is doing. Think, think Corey. Um, oh god, it... It's like, um, think as if we're just making a post in the forum and you are running Corey because th th this is this is essentially what's happening even even though it's we have already posted this 
let's just treat it as as a as, as yet another post in the storage thread. Oh, why have you done that? Why did you? No, 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 no. How do? Hmm. <laughs> Google no. And uh, before you go on, perhaps take a look at this line. They return to command. So the shit is actually starting here. Okay. Yeah. So you can you can essentially skip everything, all these lines here, and let's just work from somewhere here. And and because we already have the draft here, do not touch. So all of this do not touch. Okay. All of this. Uh, let's keep the oh hello again. But this we already have. Mm -hmm. In the next one. Like this. Okay, yeah, that's tidied that up significantly. Try to try to look at this exchange when Corey is reacting to the initial appearance of, of Alexis. So the, this really brings me back because this this here is where we can refer to um, refer to other posts or other in, other doodads. I would think that the tone Corey is telling all this would be the sea beams shot off the shoulders of Orion. That sort of <laughs> so overly epic and yes. and sort of like uh, disproportionately epic mm -hmm. and and uh, and sort of uh, there was a word here that I wanted to use and now it went away. Our So basically, epic belly flop, <laughs> or belly floppingly epic. Mm. You, you know, like he's he's telling this grand story, and their tone just doesn't fit. Um, there are events. Uh, I, I know there is one. I don't think I've got, I found it yet, but there is definitely an event where he's OTT hero te hero storytelling, you know. Mm -hmm. um, uh... And I think uh, even just one uh, one event. Would yeah, do. yeah. I'm only gonna I'm only writing these down so mm -hmm. I can pick one out. Um, uh, yeah, know, I think for for maximum irritation, I would go for an event where somebody else was also influenced, like uh, like rescuing Nox and Chaos. <laughs> they rest. They tried. The, yeah, Nox and Chaos. Uh, Nox and Corey tried to rescue Chaos from Servo because mm. Nox was Nox was left for dead. Right, he lost his arms, eye, and he's just sort of for dead and then in the notes I've written and we discuss these the bridge and the gap notes mm -hmm. um it's, it's okay 
Murph magic brings him back to life, right, is what I've got so far. And he manages to escape, get back to wherever. And then he and Corey, he and Corey and Younger Nux then go and rescue Chaos. And I found out that Chaos actually has to... Uh, she's dead, right? The Chaos in the first reality is dead because... Oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> Too many spoilers. No, no, no. Uh, uh, no, uh, I was, I'm, I'm just doing some pantomime to illustrate the story. Uh, okay, carry on. Okay. Do carry on. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm doing that. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> oh, sorry. It's because I didn't realise this, but in the deja vu thread of things, we run into the character I've labelled as Dark Chaos. Everybody get your quote unquote fingers out. The character I've labelled as, you know, the angry one mm -hmm. who's got a vengeance thing against reclaimers. The only thing the only reason she's there is because the other chaos didn't survive. And mm -hmm. so I, f I realized when I was working through I was bridging the gap notes that Chaos doesn't make it. So that could be a thing yeah, where... Yeah, but uh, again, we have many options and many timelines, so you can sort of mix and match. Yeah. So it's like maybe eventually she doesn't make it, but in the beginning maybe she does. I don't know. There, there is a choice moment there mm. in the notes. That was like, well, either chaos adapt really well to the stuff that Servo is trying to do, or she, or she doesn't, and she just dies. Or, then... or, uh, why not both and neither? Okay, I'm so confused. <laughs> so, so like, uh, okay, th this is this is all. This is all with the caveat that we are right now focusing on just one version of the character in one specific timeline with no variations given. But what if, uh, what if uh, the bad servo is running some experiments on her, and uh, and basically, how shall I say, the character becomes unusable for the heroes. <laughs> <laughs> for for the lack of better uh, better uh, explanation, so like she she doesn't need to be literally dead. She just has to be off the hero roster. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Having our cake and eating it uh, and like lying about turning it. Turning to the dark side, yo. Uh, let me write this down. So it's like the angry dark chaos is the one who is not on the dark dark side. <laughs> <laughs> it, is, it is very confusing. It will it will require specific like special chats and talks but much thought processes and discussion about bridging the gap. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Well uh off the hero roster. And and I understand that this is this is like something that happens uh, well into the storyline, right? This isn't like at the initial rescue. This is like afterwards. Yeah. Oh yes, the so notes are down. Will, she will be the code name. Would be she will be the evil twin. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, poor chaos. I'm not looking forward to writing any of those scenes, by the way, where she's at Servo Station. So <laughs> maybe we can be clever and work around that. But I think this would be a, a good... Yeah, so we'll go with the rescue of chaos. Let's do that. Rescue of chaos from Servo. I think that's the event we should go for. And this is actually going to piss Nox off a little bit. Uh, of course. Ah, oh, yeah. This can wait. When? Okay, I, I might have some confusion about the initial storyline here. So when? Uh, I I don't remember what we settled on. Like when Nux and Chaos are initially in their old Earth ship. Who picks them up? Uh, 
uh, the Taken Flight Squad. Oh, okay. the Alexis Squad, sorry. Yeah, so I, w I was actually... I, I, th I thought of that event. Oh, okay. Because that would be like, Aaron, do you remember how we saved your ass? And like, shut the fuck up, <laughs> <laughs> you, you knew nothing. <laughs> Alright, yeah, okay. Uh... And and uh, that one was technically a successful rescue mm -hmm. for, for these particular characters. So, so there is that. This... That's the thing that triggers the quote-unquote dark chaos, is that Nux was never rescued in the first place. Like, she mm -hmm. survived and the Taken Flight crew managed to pick her up, but mm -hmm. Nux never made, and that completely just changes her, it vexes her. She holds the Reclaimers responsible for that any time she gets a chance, and she's actually quite self-destructive. Um, so, that's... But that's all in a different timeline. <laughs> Oh, man. So yeah, we'll go day. with that event. Say again? Story for another day. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um. This is going to be real rough. Um. Like back in the day when we were all young and and Alexis had no uh, uh, Alexis was still a <laughs> a wee space chug with no da da da, da with, uh, with with uh, without uh, whatever engines etc etc mm -hmm. et you know that that sort of. Okay, I'm really gonna ham this, hang on. <laughs> it was a simpler time. <laughs> this might be going too over the top. Yeah, but uh, it's it's the, I think that's the goal, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, like the the text the text will need massaging, of course, but the the sentiment is is the one that I'm after here. A simpler time. This was just a just the weed tug with factory thruster set. <laughs> Ship type is probably something else, but mm -hmm. basically a wee something. <laughs> and oh, I've lost it there. Hang on. Uh, we use this. We use that ship to valiantly. Uh, uh, or on a on a valiant rescue mission at the outskirts of mapped space. That brought us uh, engineer V one here, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, his and at this point, uh, engineer V one should uh, should interrupt. Uh, basically, his speech is interrupted by V one's elbow in his ribs or something. <laughs> uh, valiant rescue. To the edge of map space to find engineer. Or at the outskirts of civilized systems. I can I can turn the ham up to eleven and beyond later. <laughs> this one goes up to eleven. <laughs> as long as you get the get the basic idea down. Uh, do we, we don't mention <coughs> uh, 
the V1 siblings. Make it count. <laughs> And I think this beach uh, is what's um, so basically the the part here. The as you as you can clearly see, we are now entering X. Uh, instead of this, uh, th th this beach takes the place of this. So yes. Yeah. So we don't need to add an extra shit. So this is where Nox would be like. What the fuck are you doing, man? Oh, hang on. This is... This... They've... They've gone from... Command center... To a different room here. Uh, yeah, but, uh... Let's... Let's skip... Too much of the diddle level, I think. Okay, so... We can get rid of this, right? Uh... Put the marker on it. Mark it with... Grey or something. So... So maybe <laughs> there is a place for... Moving on. <laughs> there's, a, there's a highlight color button now. <gasps> Just straight up next to text color. Uh, I, I still see the old view. I approve of this change. That's a good one. It's okay. the it's the way it used to be way back when oh. Alexis was still a wee wee dog. <laughs> <laughs> a wee sporen. <laughs> Yeah, because uh, I what what I'm thinking is like if uh, if there is like right now there would be one build up for Corey's and then one elbow and one what are you doing, man? But if uh, if we're doing it like in a kind of way, uh, the tension is gonna dissipate. I think maybe. Mm hmm. So yeah. it's I, I think it's it's easier to handle if we keep it all as one single escalation and and escalation and elbow event. <coughs> so and meanwhile in the background or or like then switch of perspective Smith and Taniki are poking around and noticing like Oh wait, we came through here before, and this this wasn't here. Everything's changing, and I don't feel the same. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know where that came from. <laughs> so, <clears throat> so yeah, actually, let's let's not mark it around. Let's pull it all into one escalation and and deflation. Ow! What are you doing, man? If I cut this, I'm just gonna stick it somewhere else for the time being. Yeah. So we can actually focus on what's here. Yeah, um, exactly. Uh, let me put it down. There you go. Right. Uh, next could be like, you're doing it again. Oh, here, uh, this point here that you're at. Uh, yeah. So when, so elbow to the elbow to the knee, <laughs> <laughs> elbow to the chest, whatever. Uh, and uh, and then immediately go to, dude, you are doing it again. So this could also be lost, or or compressed. And 
And I think we can even cut the whatever whatever you think you're doing. Okay. Uh, it's not working. So it's like you're doing it again. Who exactly are you trying to impress? Succinct to yep. the point. Yep. Right. Fecund. <laughs> <laughs> it's word of the week now. Um. Okay. Uh, I. Corey. Uh, but I'm supposed to be the leader. <laughs> oh, there's a there's like a weird mosquito thing in here. You can go the f away. Go <laughs> on, windows open. Bugger off! I don't want you biting me. Away. Thank you. We had mosquitoes in Kent a few years ago when I was buying the super bus, and uh, they were they were they were bad mosquitoes. They were bringing <laughs> bad stuff to England. Uh, so. And when we went to pick up the Super Bus 2, we encountered a swarm of mosquitoes. It was not good. Oh, no! But not the Mark 2, the Mark 3. So, oh. we, you know, uh, so yes. Yeah, okay, right. Back to this, the important stuff. I have depleted my tea. Oh, no! What shall I do now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, so now I can see... Da -da 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 -da. So the stuff that was between these two sentences here. Oh no 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 no! Don't don't move anything. Mm. Shh. I'm not no, I'm not, not you, <laughs> Google. <laughs> <laughs> so the the stuff that was between here is actually present in in here, and it's not helping anybody. So good riddance. This actually belongs mm -hmm. here. And I think we have reached a good sort of optimum thing. So we'll bank the video now, go do tea and such. Why not? We yeah, need, we need some adjustment time and tea and whatnot, so let us reconvene. Valued crew members shall <laughs> reconvene soon. Thank you very much for watching. Bye! Oh, I'm waving, Bye. but you can't see him. Yeah, he's waving. <laughs> Insert wave.gif here.